This is a demonstration of how to go from model object to fully functioning website in under five minutes. Using the templating technology, we have a object called web advert under the domain organization. It has an attribute name, has an attribute description, has an attribute HTML description, has a property effective date, a property expiry date, these are date time, these are, these are all strings, this is a simple object. We're going to generate the web pages, the controller, and our model view controller, and the end unit tests, and the core object, all by simply saving this templated form. All right, now let's hope it's generated all that, and we'll do a build. While that build is going on, we'll go and reload our test project. And now that's reloaded, we'll run those tests. Oh, looks like it's having trouble at the data. Let's see why. Could be the database connection on the network, or is it something else? Uh, errors, errors, errors. And the reason is, there's a SQL that we should have for the table, but since we just created the object, we don't have the object automatically created in our database. So we need to create that object in the database. And here it is right here. And we'll create it, the table, and we'll rerun our tests. And voila, 138 test cases were just run. Now, let's debug our project. Start the website. As you can tell, there's been no editing. We'll go. I did accept that. I did put this link in here to shorten the time a little bit. And now we have the page just generated. It's very simple. We're going to create a new web advert. And we'll save it. And there we have complete code where we can view the details. And we can edit. And there you have it, a fully functioning web page in under five minutes, complete with unit tests. And that's the end of the presentation.